hey, stop the presses, hold everything. There's a bug in Audacity version 2.4.1 that might affect you. So let's talk about it. There's a lot of new features in Audacity 2.4.1, some of which we've already talked about in this channel. But today I want to talk to you about a bug that I discovered concerning exporting M4A files. M4A file export relies on the FFmpeg library that you have to optionally download and install in Audacity if you want to export in M4A uh, format as well as a couple of other formats. Well, there's a bug that exists between the FFmpeg library and the ability to export M4A files. And if you export M4A files out of Audacity, this is going to affect you. You're going to want to know about this. Let me show you what I mean. In the screen that I have open here, I have a project going that I'm ready to export. And if I go up to the File menu, the drop-down menu, and I click on Export, I'm going to export it. Uh, I'm going to use the Export Audio window in this example. And of course, that opens up that window. It remembers my last settings, which is one of those new features in 2.4.2, excuse me, 2.4.1, which I really like. So it remembers that I want to export as an M4A. If I open up this window here, you can see that these bottom three files rely on the FFmpeg library. Now I can export AC3 files and Windows Media files all day long. If you look over here on the left, kind of grayed out, you can see that I've done that already. I've exported AC3. Uh, FLAC, AIFF, WAVE, and Windows Media already. The only file type that this bug seems to have a problem with is the M4A file type. So let's stay on M4A and I'm going to tell it go ahead and save this. I want to export this as an M4A file and look at the error that comes up. FFmpeg error. Can't open audio codec AAC experimental feature. That's just kind of weird. So if I click OK, I get another error that says unable to export. Now again, this only happens on M4A files. It doesn't happen on any other of those file types that, re that rely on the FFmpeg library. So I'm going to click OK here. And if I come up to the Audacity drop-down window and I go to Preferences, and I look under my Libraries uh, tab here in my Preferences window, it sees the FFmpeg library version. I know that it sees it because I'm able to export in other formats. Now I went through the whole process here because I was getting kind of frustrated with this and I did a locate again. So I click on that and it comes back and says, yay, I located it. I automatically detected it. It's a, it's a valid library. Do you want to locate it manually? Originally I said yes and I went out and located it again manually a couple of times, two or three times. And each time I didn't, I got the same error window when I tried to export as an M4A file. I even followed all the instructions on the user forum to reset everything within Audacity. I reset my plugin library. I reset the program itself. I did everything but download a brand new program and I still couldn't down or still couldn't export as an M4A file. Well then I discovered this verbiage on the user forum which basically says there is a bug in version 2.4.1 concerning exporting M4A files, and the fix is going to be in version 2.4.2. So I just wanted to make you aware that that bug exists, and if you come across it like this, don't get frustrated like I did and, you know, try and redo everything and, you know, spend an hour with it trying to figure out what's going on with your program. It's just a bug in the program that's going to be fixed in the next version. Hey, if you like what's going on here, please think about subscribing to my channel, and I'll see you next time.